In Lab 3, you are asked to share your Excel file that you created or uploaded to OneDrive with me. So I want to make sure that everybody knows exactly how to do that. Um, so I'm just going to pretend that this is the, the workbook that I want to share. So you're going to need to open that workbook. And you might already have it open because you're working on it. And after you have opened it, you are going to click Share. Please don't send me the link this way. Um, it can get lost in an avalanche of email sometimes. So instead of inviting me to your workbook, you are going to select Get a Link. And then all you're going to have to do is copy this link. You can see that right now this is an edit link. If you don't want me to have edit access, then you can click Create Another Link and choose View Only. Either one is fine with me. But whichever link you choose, you're simply going to select the whole link, use Control c on your keyboard to copy, and then you will simply go back to Blackboard, click on the assignment just like you would to submit your actual spreadsheet. So I can click on the assignment. However, instead of clicking Browse Your Computer to actually browse to the file, you're just going to click Write Submission, and you can simply use Control v on your keyboard to paste that link in, and that's all I need. Now if you want to go one step further, you can then select your link, and then click the Insert or Edit Link button, and paste the link again. It's still on my clipboard, so I just use Control v again, and change this to Open in a New Window. And once you do that, you notice that it's now highlighted in blue, which means that when I'm grading, all I have to do is click on that link and it will open automatically. And then you will be able to just click Submit. Now, um, for example, Chapter 4 has you submit after you complete Number 8, but then there are two questions to answer in Number 10. So you can answer those questions that are in Number 10 just right here in that same submission area. And so then you could just type in your answers and then click Submit down at the bottom of the page. And that is all that you would need to do to send me that link from OneDrive.